Hello again, everybody. This is Jim, your product expert with Water Pumps Direct, coming to you with another Q&A video for your viewing pleasure, enjoyment, and hopefully some good information for you today. Today, we're going to talk about gas pumps 102 and high pressure pumps. What are these used for and what's their intended application? So again, like any other pump, they're, they're used for, point, for moving water from point A to point B, um, but they're going to be able to provide higher heads, which equates to higher pressure. Um, you know, if you need to pump something and, and water, you need to pump water really high vertically or really far horizontally, these are the pumps you're going to be looking at. Uh, now, you still need to check the pump curves, flow rates, and things like that to make sure you're going to get what you're looking to do and what kind of flow rates you're looking to achieve. You may actually need to increase uh, hose diameter if you're running extensively long distances to uh, account for friction loss and, and flow loss over those long distances. So you still need to check that and make make sure you do some homework there. And, um, you know, if you're fighting fires with it or something like that, you know, make sure that uh, you're running the right pressure that you need. Um, most nozzles and for most fire hoses and all that stuff usually do pretty well between about between 50 and 80 PSI. Um, so make sure that the pump you're working with is going to give you the right pressure. Don't deadhead the pump. And by that, I mean, if you have a nozzle on there, you're fighting a fire, don't ever shut that nozzle off while the pump is running. Because that uh, pump doesn't know that they're not uh, allowing water to flow through that hose. You're going to have some kind of uh, balloon blowing up somewhere at some point. It's going to be the hose or the pump. It ain't going to be pretty, and it could be very dangerous. So just be very careful with that. Um, use a good strainer on the end of that suction hose, wherever you're pulling that water from, and uh, you'll be good to go. And so, you know, that's pretty much it on these pumps. You know, you'll notice that on um, these pump curves, uh, as opposed to some other ones, some of these pumps can achieve a, a head lift of over 300 feet. Now, that equates to pretty good pressure. That's going to equate to well over 100 PSI. So, again, high pressure, longer distances, higher head lifts, um, different applications. Hopefully, it gives you a little insight on what these pumps are used for, their intended purpose. If you have any other questions on this or other products we have on our website, more Q&A videos. Give me a call, shoot me an email, check out our website, waterpumpsdirect.com. Check out our how-to library when you get there. A lot of great, inf great information for you. And subscribe to our YouTube channel. Until next time, y'all have a great day. Take care.